first episode and every episode we're going to try and have a little setup out front because sometimes inside is not so accessible or we're under construction in there translate that into it is under construction in there <laughs> <That's your turn. laughs> translate translate that into <laughs> we're under construction in there it's a nice door isn't it dan mm -hmm. look at it I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get the whole thing in. Maybe if I hold it way, way back across the room. And test fitting the door. Well, it's so hard to get a good angle on that. Well. It's a nice, beautiful door. Uh, there was a matching door with it, but it was too chewed up. I think- uh, <laughs> Too chewed? Chewed up <laughs> choo -choo. from the dog, I think, maybe. Uh uh. Molly, maybe that's where you smell the dog. Maybe. Anyway, we're gonna finish the drywall and then we're gonna do a door jam around the door and then we're gonna do trim mm -hmm. off the door jam there and there'll be a small piece of trim going up there all the way around. Alrighty. And so, what do you put in that? Like what we put in that closet. In the closet? Yeah. For when uh, the pandemic hit, you bought the uh, <laughs> yeah. 100 packs of toilet paper. I did not do that. <laughs> Scrapey Lou. Out in the workshop. Out in the... With Molly. Workshop with the uh, very low door scraping away. I might need it to be raised up a bit because I'm sort of leaning over a bit. Oh. I often find that I'm ahead of a counter, so there are 12 on this side. Oh. <laughs> Flip it over, there's 12. So there's 24 in total. I don't mean to be a mathematician or anything, but um, so I'm on number 20 more to go after I've done this one. I have a uh, exacto knife, and I'm just going along the um, uh, the edge right in, which sort of gives you a nice crisp line. So you just all the way around, all the way, the way around, and hopefully you're just on the glass and not on the wood. I'm actually using it in the holder as opposed to just the blade, which I've used just the blade before. And note, both of the are in the blade or in the holder. So you don't cut yourself. Yeah, I hope <laughs> there isn't a later video with a band-aid around. Yeah. <laughs> And then I take the um, the flat blade, and then there's a primer in there, and then there's three coats of paint on there. But it does take a bit of elbow, a little grease to get it. <laughs> to get it, it's number 24, and I'm getting it of order there. This is the back side? This is the back side, and it has like a putty to it. It actually is coming off easier. This side's been easier than the other, surprisingly, but it's... Because uh, this is where it's all been... The glass has been puttied in. I have stopped to pick up a couple of things that Dan and I saw on the weekend when we um, came to the flea market. But here I am. I'll, uh, I'll show you the things that I'm going to get. And I'm just looking for the booth that had something that I really wanted to stop and pick up and show. Maddie, it must be the next one. Oh yeah, here it is here. Okay, so it is a dish rack that can be easily painted. And it just fits the plate, right? Like it, there's no spots for glasses and the cutlery part 
it lays down. Shine, 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 shine. Look at that. So the door's painted now. Now we can reinstall our brass pieces that uh, we shine back up on the wheel and buffing wheel. Buffing wheel. We're gonna fix back in the in there. We may have to tap it in because there's a little uh, paint on there. Now nice and gently put it back in. So it's seated back in. Nice that looks in there. God, he blew it the other way. God, he blew it the other way. So the handle part is up top, and then we got the spot for the uh, key. In your bag of tricks. Mm -hmm. Is it because the latch is in? So we found the hole. Okay, great. It's really nice on the black paint. We even shined up the screws. On the buffing wheel? On the buffing wheel. You can see the difference between the two screws. So this one's kind of rounded top. Mm -hmm. And this one's like a flat top. Mm -hmm. And I think those are used on a different spot on the door. I'll just look at the screws here and see if I can find. Take this one back out. Round top. Put it so that the it lines up and down. Get it in. It's a little something that every little detail. Every little detail. Okay, so the next thing I don't think I'm gonna get this, but look at that box. Do you see it with the ships? Looks like um. Uh, Cameo, and it measures probably about I don't know a foot by eight inches by about three inches tall. My favorite thing about this is that it reminds me of a cameo, and I've had it out of the container, but it's uh, out of the glass case. But it's quite, and it's quite heavy. So cameos are made of uh, shell, and I don't think this is made of shell, but it is. Uh, it reminds me of that. But of course, the ships. My, uh, my big saying is there are tall ships and small ships and ships that sail the sea. The best ships are friendships, may that always be. So now we're on to the other part. This, uh, this does the internal lock on the top and the bottom this one's for the top where you turn this latch and this rod goes up and down so this goes up into the frame to lock it into place if you want to lock it so this gets threaded into here on the inside in the door hmm. which took me a bit to figure out how to take it apart well, let's just see how you figure getting put back together. So we got it in place. Then we're going to slide this down. You can see it right down in here. Mm -hmm. Let's just see if we can find it. Mm. 
Lefty Lucy, righty daddy, lefty Lucy, righty daddy, lefty Lucy, righty daddy, lefty Lucy, light righty daddy, lefty Lucy, righty daddy, righty daddy. Put some of the screws out there. Point the same way. Just some anal that way. We can readjust them after. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And they cover up this. Mm. We need to tap that in so that we're almost too far. And you have to uh, turn that without this on there. Put the screws in there. Let's make sure it still turns. One time uh, Janelle and I came and we went through every baggie and picked out all the ones that we wanted. That's pretty. That's a really pretty color. Do you like that color? He's still there. Look at him. Okay. Tony the Tiger, as Danny, Danny, Dan referred to him as. Do you think that one's good? For inside the linen closet. There is just so many things to see, Maddie. Oh, and then, oh, there is another thing on my list. Do you like any of those guys? So the only thing that I would still get is the um, that the box, which is crazy. Like that's a crazy purchase. Great. So we got the uh, door mounted now. Mm -hmm. We got it on the hinges. Mm -hmm. We got the paint scraped. Mm -hmm. We just need to uh, finish up the hardware on it. And as you can see, we got it to close. It's gonna look great on there. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna hold back a little bit and then we can do the big reveal when it's all oh, organized. Oh, I see. I didn't realize it. Was. Mm -hmm. So we gotta finish putting our screws in here. I don't know if you noticed the uh, screwdriver that I'm using. What about the screwdriver that you use? Get a close up at the end of that screwdriver oh. with the culprit. Uh huh. Look at her. Right here. Oh, 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 oh. Molly. <laughs> okay, so that's that's it for this piece here. I don't know why we'll need a door handle on the inside. Apparently back in the day, it was a, I think it was a French door, like a pair of doors, which would have divided a room. Do you know why you say that it was a French, like it was a double door? Because of this yes, yes. groove where the other door would fit into. Look at it. Now all I have to oops. Now all I have to do is clean that glass. It looks a little frosted right now. Mm -hmm. But it I'm happy with that. We're gonna see how it turns out. Yeah. I've never had the luxury of um, uh, scraping a door as it is laying down and it, it or painting really. I usually paint them once they're installed, but so Is this it? It's the big reveal.
reveal, Dan. Come big on reveal. In. So the big reveal of the linen closet. Let's uh, define that. And uh, still lots of work uh, in the bathroom to do. We just got the windows installed today. And so there's the trim around the windows that needs to be done, but come on, come on. Oh, oh look at that. Look at that. Opens the door. Mm. It has linen closet. Just the basics in there right just now? Just the basics, yep. And we got Tony oh, the Tiger in there. Yeah, Tony the Tiger from the flea market or the mm -hmm. antique market, whatever you want to call it. Brocante, as mm -hmm. it's sometimes referred to as. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, that's really nice. Yeah, yeah, it is really nice. And the, the latch works and stays closed and mm -hmm. all works and yeah. All that... Uh... It was a lot of work for that uh, door. I know. A lot of painting, a lot of scraping, a lot of buffing. Yep. A lot of screwing. A lot of driving to get the oh. to get the door. Picked this door up in Ottawa. Yeah. Some back road, whatever. Yep. Anyway, I think it looks great. Yeah. Got it all framed in, trimmed out. Yeah. And so, uh, if you don't do this kind of work yourself, you don't have the knowledge that of what it takes to put that kind of stuff together. But it took a couple of oh, couple of weeks worth of effort. It's not every, you're not working on it every day, but no. between coats of paint and scraping and buffing and all the things that uh, all the things that are necessary mm -hmm. to get something to that state, that's that's what you're at. Like mm -hmm. it, it does take effort. So. Well, have you ever heard the expression? You could build a house around that door. We, <laughs> we have built a linen closet around <laughs> that door. Yeah. And I would say uh, some of the other things are the, the hinges on it. That took effort. Spray painting those. Mm -hmm. and, uh, there's sort of a unique uh, unique structure to, uh, to to get that. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. No, I think it looks great. Yeah. Worth the effort. Yep. And the last... Great job, Dan. No, so did you. Oh, I, thank you. No, you did. Thank you. You no, did a great you job, did. too. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, it'll last a lifetime. There's nowhere that we will go, not go, to get a door. <laughs> oh my God. Dan, this yeah. is insane. <laughs> this is getting a door. <laughs> okay, it's a little bit slippy. You do have to slow down. <laughs>